So this lesson is on Coursera, which is affordable online courses. So first we'll go through what Coursera actually is. Then it will be kind of like a step-by-step -step tutorial on accessing the website, signing up and enrolling, and some alternative programs if you don't like Coursera. So first, number one, intro to Coursera. Coursera is a global online learning platform that offers affordable, remote access to online courses and degrees from leading universities and companies. Coursera partners with over 200 educational and corporate institutions to bring online learning to individuals and organizations from around the world. From hands-on projects and courses to job-ready certificates and degree programs, there are 82 million learners with 100 plus Fortune 500 companies and more than 6,000 campuses, businesses, and governments come to Coursera to access world-class learning. So some of the topics, they're broken into 11 areas, data science, health, business, math and logic, computer science, social sciences, personal development, physical science and engineering, information technology, language learning, and art and humanities. So some pros and cons of Coursera are, so the pros are that there's 7,000 plus world-class course offerings from institutions like Google, Duke, HEC Paris, and more. It's all remote, so you don't go in person, you just do it from your laptop. There's also 1,700 free courses, so you won't have to pay the fee. You can And you can sign up for multiple different courses so you can learn at your own pace. And then some cons about it are that some programs are more expensive than others. And then some courses, like probably the computer science ones would require prior knowledge. So not all of them are beginner friendly and they're not suited for those who don't do both independent learning. So number two is accessing the website. So these are just like following screenshots that help you break it down. So using a web browser, you'd enter this into the search bar. Then this is what would appear. So you want to sign up or connect with a dedicated course for your business. That's this. This is to explore or search for specific topics. And here is to explore online degrees, careers, or universities. And then if you scroll down, you can see more information like professional certificates and master's and bachelor's degrees with all these subjects here. And continued, the more you scroll down, it breaks it down into the 11 subjects, which we just mentioned. And then there's also Coursera for business. So if you're like, yeah. And then based on what you hover your mouse over, you are able to view the different degrees and certificates for a career, learning a new skill, or trying to earn an educational degree. Like, yeah, take a free course, earn a degree, and earn a certificate. So if you're looking to complete an online degree, enter the information relevant to your experience, then click See Programs. So for example, they clicked on Online Degrees, and then this would appear to say, I have a blank degree, the type's in associate, and then I want a bachelor's degree in business. And then you can either email the information or you can just see the list of programs. You can also earn an accredited professional certificate in your preferred field. The seven day free trial starts, it's a seven day free trial and it starts at $40 a month, $50 Canadian. So three, how to sign up and enroll. So first, in the website, there's a button saying join for free, so you can click that. It will ask for your full name, email address, and a password between 8 and 72 characters. But if you already have Google or a Facebook account, you can just sign up using those. So you can add your current work experience, education, or career goal to receive personalized recommendations based on this information. This step is optional, so you don't have to do it. It would just give you more curated options. And then after that, you will be sent to your account dashboard. Here you can make changes to your account, 
access courses that are in progress or completed, and also see recommendations based on your career or educational goals. Like, yeah, here it says, tell us about yourself. I'm currently a software developer slash engineer. You can change your career or level up your skills. And if you continue to scroll down, you'll be able to view more recommendations of courses like Master of Computer Information Technology and Master of Business Administration. So to enroll in a class from the homepage, you can search for a specific course or explore the recommendations. For this example, I will be entering free Excel in the search box on the left and clicking on the magnifying glass as a search. And then you can look through the available courses and select the one that you are interested in by clicking on it. So in this example, they clicked on introduction to Microsoft Excel. Then read through the course description, reviews, skills you will develop, requirements, and more. Like this, for example, it's here. In this free guided project, you would create a spreadsheet, create simple formulas, and showcases hands-on experience. And these are the requirements, so just no download needed, a split-screen video, it's English, desktop only. And for the requirements, you only need just familiarity with computers and the internet. And when you're ready to enroll, click on enroll for free and then continue. Then you will be given a project overview of the course you will take. You'll be given a project overview of the course you will take and then whenever you are ready to begin, you get to like get started. So it's just like a short paragraph here and then has your learning journey beneath that. Then this is also optional, but you can set a weekly goal for yourself. So you'll be tracked. And they also say that learners who set a goal are 75% more likely to compete to complete the course. Then you can always change your thing. So for example, two days a week, three days a week, and five days a week. And then you can also look at grades, notes, forums, messages, and more on the left while you complete the course. This is the interface of the course. So when you click on it, it would have, you can leave the session at any time. There would be also a video playing here. This is where like your instructions will be. And this is where your cloud workspace would be. And then you can log into your account to continue the course at a later time and click anywhere on the course to access it. Once you complete the course, you'll earn a certificate. Yep, see here, 50% progress. And then there's Coursera Plus, which is an optional paid subscription for unlimited access to all of Coursera's courses, projects, and certificate programs. There's over 7,000 of them. You can earn unlimited certificates with a seven-day free trial, then Canadian 74 per month, or $502 per year with a 14 day money back guarantee. And then here are some alternate programs to Coursera if you don't like the price point or just wanna try something new. So there's Masterclass, which you can take classes from celebrities and other professionals. And that is $240 per year for unlimited access. There's Skillshare, which is thousands of hands-on creative classes with one free month and then 168 per year for unlimited access. Then EDX, which is for individual courses, $50 and up. For professional programs, $300 and up. And if you want a degree, it's $10,000 and up. And then finally, Udemy, which has the biggest pool of courses. And then individual courses can go from $13 to $200. And then, yeah, as of now, that's it. This is just a live demo now. So thanks for listening. If you would like to learn this lesson with the Cyber Seniors Mentor, please go to www.cyberseniors.org or call 1-844-217-5000.
3057 to register for a one-on-one -on -one phone session. We also host weekly tech drop-in sessions from 2 to 3 p.m. ET every Thursday. And if you'd like to donate to Cyber Seniors, go to cyberseniors.org slash support slash us. Okay, so now we're on the Coursera website. So here are some of the main features. You, this is some career options. There's a project manager, data analysts, IT support specialist. And then this is what was in the slideshow. You can find a top degree that fits your life. You could be a Bachelor of Applied Arts and Sciences or a Master of Computer Science and Data Science. And then these are master track certificates, which you can open new doors with graduate level learning. So you could get you can learn from top universities to get certificates. And then with the university certificates, you can accelerate your growth with graduate level learning, such as AI marketing certificate, digital transformation certificate, and an Oxford FinTech program. And then now going to explore, you could take a free course, earn a degree, in one of these sections, earn a certificate, advance your career, or find your new career. And these are the 11 subjects that we went over. And then, so now if I wanna search for something like art, I will get some courses that I can take like modern and contemporary art design in the studio, post-war abstract painting, or visualizing women's work using art media for social justice. And then if I wanted to filter, so you'll probably get some other things just like business and computer science. If you just wanted things like art, you can click here in the filter section, just click on art and you'll only get results for arts and humanities programs. And yeah, so, if I'll go through a class, for example, the modern and postmodern, and then let me find the rating and reviews. So it has, this should be a good program because it has a 4.8 out of five stars and a 98%. And with 115,000 people already enrolled and it's offered by Wesleyan University. And then if you want to, if you want to sign up for free, their button is here, enroll for free, financial aid available as well. So now I have to sign up. Let me just log in with the cyber seniors email. Just five demo six zero four two. And then so yeah, so if you want the certificate, it's just 49 USD. And then full course nor certificate, it's free. So you can just sign up like this because you will still have all access to all course materials. You just won't have the certificate. And then this is where you would enter your work experience or your occupation, your experience level, employers, degrees, university. And yeah, so let me just skip this for now. So yeah, now this is the page that you would open now that I'm enrolled in this class. And now let me, so now that I'm enrolled in my class, if I wanted to see my specific courses, I can just go to my username in the top right corner here and then go to my courses. And it would just, this is like the main homepage. And this is how you could find this, so the modern and postmodern. And then here you can find your grades. 
you can have notes that you can make. There's some discussion forums that people have posted for answers to their problems. There's messages that you would receive a Gandhi since they just signed up for the course and just course information. And yeah, that's it for the live demo.